Today I'm going to explain how you can attract someone and make them like just talking in 90 seconds. Here author is saying 90 seconds because research shows that nowadays our attention span has reduced very much. For example, magazine ads have only 2 seconds to grab your attention. And if you like that ad in those 2 seconds, then only you will give your time to that ad. If you don't find it attractive, you simply turn the page over and move on. Similarly, just after few seconds of our conversation with other people, they easily make their opinion about us. So it becomes necessary for us to form a good impression at start only and to capture their attention at the same time. This can be really very helpful and useful for your personal and professional life. Most of the people fail to understand what they must talk when they meet someone for the first time. This makes them nervous and they start behaving awkward. Then as a result for which, what happens? They fail to form a good bond or relation with the opposite person. And many times people don't like them. Even they don't want to talk with them again because of their first bad impression. So if you don't want such things happening to you or if you want to learn forming a strong connection with people and want to impress people by talking, then this video is for you. So in today's video, I will share how you can form emotional level connection with anyone, what we should talk and how we should talk with others. So after understanding all these things, sure you will become a professional communicator. So just stay with me till the end of the video. In order to make these things possible, we first need to understand these three points. First point is meeting. Second point is establishing a rapport. Third and last is communicating. To meet any person and start communicating with them between these two important steps of meeting and communication, 90 seconds window appears. In those 90 seconds, you can create rapport and can make emotional level of connection with people. I will explain later what exactly rapport is, so don't worry. These points are really very important. I will explain each point in detail. Let's start with number one, which is meeting. If you give your right impression within three or four seconds of meeting someone, it will make you look trustworthy, sincere and safe, which is really important to create a rapport. So now I will share five small tips. By following these tips, within few seconds, you can create right impression. Number one, be open. It means to have an open attitude and body language, not closed. For example, if you are talking to someone by folding your hand or sitting by taking less space, then all these examples are for closed body language. Whereas if you keep your hands open and keep a space between your legs, and take space while sitting or standing, these are open body language examples. So always try to form open body language while meeting someone. By doing this, you will appear impressive. Remaining four points are also about open body language, so do follow them as well. Number two, eye contact. Remember that keeping an eye contact will show how much confident and attractive you are. Whereas maintaining less eye contact shows you that you are nervous, lying or you are uninterested which is not at all good for most of the time. One more thing, it's not like you shouldn't look anywhere and you just need to maintain an eye contact always. You must maintain eye contact as per situation, if needed. If eye contact isn't required in particular situation, still you do, then you can look weird. Number three, a genuine smile. After doing an eye contact, we must give a smile to the person before him. Doing this will reflect your positive attitude and do remember, you must give a genuine and friendly smile, not creepy or weird smile. Number 4. Greeting After smiling, you must start a conversation by greeting them with good tone and full of energy. By saying hi, hello or salam. Anything through which you want to start your conversation. And do remember, the more nicely you introduce yourself, more nicely opposite person will also introduce themselves. Also, this is the good time to know more about the opposite person. For example, if you meet someone and say hello, then opposite person will also reply that much only by saying hello or hi, that's it, and will remain quiet. So this thing can make the situation more awkward and weird. But if you say, hello, my name is John and I am a doctor, so even you will get a big reply like, I am Mike and I am a businessman. I know this isn't best example, but you must have understood. The more nicely you introduce yourself, the more big reply you will receive with the help of which you can expand your conversation. Number 5. Lean While talking to someone slightly lean forward, not much but little. This will show to the opposite person that you are interested in them and in their talk. It is also comfortable and open with them. Try not to do this so much while meeting the opposite sex, otherwise you can look needy and desperate, which doesn't look good. 
Now the second part comes establishing rapport. Amongst all three parts, this is the most important part because here you can form mental and emotional level connection with people because of which people will start liking you at some different level. You all must be aware that humans are emotional creatures who mostly take decisions through heart not through brain and forming rapport will help us to create emotional connection by understanding others feelings and emotions. So now I will share some points to form a strong rapport. Number one attitude. Sometimes while talking to your close friends or family you realize that they are sad or angry. You ask them what happened is everything okay? At that moment they give a fake smile and says yes everything is okay I'm fine to which you don't believe and later you come to know that yes you were thinking right about his emotion well because of some reasons we come to know that they are lying but have you ever thought what is that reason through which we come to know that something is wrong so answer for this because of their attitude because of our attitude directly impacts our mind and our mind is fully connected to our body so what happens if your attitude is full of anger no matter how nicely you try to talk but people will understand your anger through facial expression through your voice tone and through your body language which will not allow you to build a rapport so instead of keeping negative attitude while talking to people such as anger bored impatient try to keep positive attitude while talking to people like be calm relax patient and confident number 2 art of synchronization Suppose you like cricket then your bonding will be more with those people who have same interest like you if you like watching GOT then you will love to spend time with GOT fans you must have noticed that people with common interest easily get up with each other and become comfortable to each other easily and form connection why this happens because we love to spend time with those people who are like us or have same interest like us people who have similar thinking have similar ideas about life like minds find like minds not always but most of the time our bonding will be less with those people who are opposite to us so if we synchronize with others or if we do things like them this thing will really help us to form a rapport i will not talk about thoughts and ideas it can differ but i will talk about some practical things which can be similar to all which we can easily synchronize and can form connection to other people number 3 congruity we are watching any movie or series and we knew deep inside our heart that whatever is going on is fake but still when any of our favorite character dies or anything bad happens to them we feel bad we feel angry and few people even cry even after knowing that fact that it was fake it wasn't real we believe all the things which we see in that movie or series and get much emotionally connected with it why this happen this is something we need to think about well the reason for this is congruity if you want people to believe you and to form emotional connection with you then try to be congruent here i have explained two parts meeting and rapport and third part is communicate in third part i will explain how to communicate with people and what to talk most of the people don't understand what they must talk when they meet someone for the first time what they must talk to make their conversation interesting so that people love their company however this is an important and big topic so i will explain it in next video whatever i have explained in this video do implement it in real life just by watching videos at home nothing will going to happen nowadays we spend much of our time with our cell phones that we are forgetting the importance of doing face to face conversation try to use your phone less and meet up people in real i have shared all this knowledge from the book how to make people like you in 90 second by nicholas if you want to improve your communication skill and want to become an impressive person then do buy this book it will be very helpful for you also please do share this video so that people generate interest of reading books and our life becomes great thanks for watching